Y'all, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? It's your girl, I am newbie Nova. Back with another intuitive time with motherfucking me, y'all. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? My kings, my queens, my loves, my babies. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? I'm out there to pre pull tonight. I was just sitting here playing with the cars, pulling them, you know, debating if I wanted to do a read or not, because, you know, I'm at work on the grind all the time, period. Time is 1257 October 26th. Okay. Which will be that 1212 energy. 1212 energy. Okay. Going back to that 33 energy. And what I was getting from the cards, I just kept hearing imitation, 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 imitation. And then this came on the radio and next time I find a love, I make sure she's my friend. Okay. God grant us the sinner you accept the things that we cannot change, the courage change the things that we can, the wisdom to know the difference. I said God grant us the sinner you accept the things that we cannot change, the courage change things that we can, and the wisdom to know the difference. I say, I say, I say, I say, I say, I say. Okay. Also, I was getting from this was a lot of heavy narcissistic ass energy. Very narcissistic. This is the type of person. They're overt narc. They like to play the, well, what did I do? Urkel voice type shit. Or I did it. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, you did. So stop acting like you don't know what the fuck going on. I just seen explicit. I have seen fake, fake twin, cat in a hat, no Dr. Seuss, yeah. Okay. So, the first card that came out was, you my son under my wing, fucked up service. So, somebody is around you that's like a friend of me energy or however you want to take it. We are energy flowing over here if you knew my channel. Okay, I'm about to just jump right into this. Because the downloads is coming. Okay. 44%. On the motherfucking percentage. I know y'all see that 44. Okay. Period. 33 is 44. 12, 12 is on the clock. Go to your angel numbers. Do your life path numbers. Do your angel numbers. Do your life path numbers. Do go do your numerology, baby. All right. Somebody trying to act like they got your best interest, but they really don't got your best interest. Because they say you, my son, under my wing, they say fucked up service. There's a motherfucker that one minute they act like they cool with you, next minute they ain't gonna be cool with you. Or punching back syndrome type shit. You feel me? Like, ain't nobody got time for that shit. Oh, excuse me. I keep burping. Don't nobody got time for that. Then in reverse, I got noodles, macaroni, and cheese. Then it said begging for another chance. Embarrassment. So this is an old cheesy, corny ass motherfucker. That's a chitter chatty motherfucker that's always talking behind somebody back or something. Always begging, asking for something, stirring the pot. Heard they want to stir the pot, I'm going to hand a bitch a spoon. I'm tired of you fake ass, snake ass, nothing ass, want to be something ass bitches. I really been sparing you hoes. I been could have y'all niggas. Tired of y'all snake ass hating ass on on some so won't be <laughs> thug ass niggas. I really miss your nigga hate me because I've been shitting on y'all bitches. Okay? That's what I'm getting from that. Megan Thee Stallion ungrateful. Like, yeah. Somebody just corny as hell. Um, every nigga favorite to get played with. I'm the type of shit because hoes can't hang with. Okay? Because then after that, it says bi-weekly, Friday after next. Another day, another dollar, another 
week another bill. So they always just looking like for another scheme, another plot to like try to just do some dumbass shit. You know what I'm saying? And they looking at you like shit. Every time I turn around, it's like some different shit going on with you. Your hair different, your outfit different, you going somewhere different, you with different people. You know what I'm saying? The decorations in your house might be fucking different. Like it's always an upgrade with you or something. This person's in competition. I'm hearing Lifetime movies. Lifetime movies. I'm seeing this Lifetime movie where the lady um, lived next door. And she has some type of syndrome. I forgot what the syndrome is called. But it's like basically, uh, it's like a hypochondriac. And um, she started dressing like the lady. Dyed her hair the same color. Like, got the same doll. Like, the bitch was trying to actually, like, with real life be her. Like, shit was fucking crazy. But we're going to tap more into this energy. We already got six minutes on the clock. I just need 6 9 Cancer energy. And it's raining outside. Heavy water energy. Cancer's Pisces Scorpio. Banking. They banking that you go along with acting like you up under their fucking wing. And what they don't want you to know because it came out flipped towards me in the reverse is dream person. Be the person you want attraction. They see you being the person that you want to be. And they don't like that. And they banking that you follow behind them. That shit is fucking crazy. That's the fucked up service. They trying to get you, try to um, clout your judgment. Like I've been saying, I better fucking cover up y'all shit. Cover y'all fucking craniums. And it's starting to be cold and shit outside, so y'all need to cover y'all shit any fucking way. This should be a time that y'all let y'all hair breathe a little bit more or something. Or do a little bit more of a better protective style. You know what I'm saying? Fellas, y'all can let y'all hair, you know, do a thing a little bit more or something. And it says, no weapon form against me shall prosper. Begging for another chance, yeah. But no weapon formed against you shall prosper. They corny as fuck. You can see this shit from a mile of fucking way. And then shopping spree. Bi-weekly. Friday after next. Another day, another dollar, another week, another bill. They constantly see you going through fucking upgrades. And they over here like, what the fuck? No weapon formed against chance you shall motherfucking prosper. At the top of the deck. Looking in the mirror unfit. Bump your head enough times you'll find out. Yeah. You done bumped your head enough motherfucking times. You're becoming the person that you want to be. That's where they're fucking mad. But they banking that you don't figure this out. These people are unfit. That's why they got fucked up service. And also you need to do some more mirror magic. Or somebody's trying to do mirror magic on you. Like I said. Somebody's trying to um copy you. I seen the Dr. Seuss copycat card. Heavy narcissistic energy. Like, this person is trying to sabotage you for whatever fucking reason. Receiving grants on... Yeah, they're trying to... They're trying to stop your bad. Receiving grants, loans, credit, etc. Motherfuckers look out for you. The universe looks out for you. You're fucking chosen. These motherfuckers trying to stop your bad, but no weapon formed against you to prosper. The abundance of cash flow... Spare change, spend it, get it back tenfold. They don't understand the laws of motherfucking attraction. That's why they don't understand how you're becoming the person that you want to motherfucking be. That's how you're getting all these loans and credit and shit. You feel me? Like, come on now. Bottom of the day. PDA, sexual and public, explicit. Um, you could be getting a lot of sexual attention or something like that. I'm hearing Roxanne, Roxanne. Roxanne, Roxanne. Go watch the um, Roxanne, Roxanne story. Um, Want to be my... Something about want to be my man. Something, something. It's a documentary on her life and um, the rapper, upcoming rapper and shit like that. Um, You could be younger and an older man is going to try to approach you and try to knock you off your fucking square. So be careful about that too that happened in the Roxanne, Roxanne. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you're like a beautiful or handsome person. You know what I'm saying? I'm seeing um, Love and Basketball. And he was telling him, don't let no, don't go knock up no girl and shit. Buy into stocks. Do research first. Yeah, you about to be buying into stocks and doing all this other type of shit. Let me grab these cards from down here real quick. 
yeah, I'm gonna go in the order that they came out though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The fact that you are starting to become more of a boss woman, you're going to be around different type of men and stuff, um, or becoming more attractive because it's like now people are seeing like another side to you that they didn't see before or something like that as well. In the reverse, dance to make her dance, strip club, make it rain, trick. Yeah, people are going to be, um, I got that million dollars. <laughs> That's so funny, especially after blah, 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 blah. let me not even go there, but yeah, I'm cracking the fuck up. Okay, so this could be somebody who's mad of how you get your money. Okay, you could used to get your money like them or never got your money like them, but however, y'all still got to a bag. This person is mad of how you get your bag compared to how they gotta go get their fucking bag. I'm hearing Big Lotto. She had to do what? She had to fuck who to get to the top? Some some something. Mm -hmm on whatever new song or freestyle she just did so yeah i'm also seeing um players club like i said y'all could have been getting y'all money the same way but is you like what is you really doing that shit for are you doing it with a goal in mind i'm seeing power you know what i'm saying bmf like is you doing this shit for a goal or is you just doing this shit just because you lost like you lost the stuck or something then again that narcissistic energy motherfuckers thing just cause they cute and shit or whatever all that ain't even all that you know what I'm saying PDA sexual and public again you know what I'm saying strip club dance to make her dance take it how it resonates somebody could be getting took it out of the strip club as well somebody could be getting mad about that game <laughs> For the best or worst, that's completely up to you. Yeah, like I just said. What the fuck is you really doing shit for? Even when you get this money and these do these investments, do your research and shit. So you're not fucking up. You bump your head enough times, you'll understand. You don't bump your head enough times with a little bag. Now you're about to get blessed with a big bag. You know what I'm saying? Are you going to take this as a gain or a loss? You know what I'm saying? Even if you do lose it, you got to bump your head enough time to understand. So, God's still going, you know what I'm saying? But he might just baby step it a little bit. But he going to see what the fuck you going to do with that shit. You still going to get it regardless. No weapon form against you should prosper. Yeah, big chop. You could be doing a dramatic change or people, places, and things. A big drastic change with people, places, and things. A big chop is coming something when doors close and new ones open. When doors close, new ones open. So take that however it resonates. You're doing drastic changes with yourself, people, places, or things. In the reverse, fly as fuck, but house nasty as fuck, make it make sense. Yeah. A motherfucker is mad at your lifestyle. They're like, damn, how do how they keep they keep they self up and still maintain the house still maintain the kids still maintain a man still maintain a lifestyle still maintain any habits if they have any vices or habits or goals hobbies whatever the fuck the case may be like how is they so balanced motherfuckers be mad about this shit or you know what i'm saying Motherfuckers could be trying to say certain shit about you behind your back like this. But then when motherfuckers come around you and get to know you and see certain shit, they like, I don't see none of that. You know what I'm saying? Even if the house is a little bit messed up or something like that. Like, it ain't to the extent like how you trying to paint it up, bitch. Like, fuck. Like, you hating. Like, why you hating like that? It's going to come to the light. Motherfuckers is hating. It's going to be a big chop. You know what I'm saying? Or it's bright. Don't dim light yeah your aura is bright as fuck you see right through people motherfucking bullshit you bumped your head enough motherfucking time to see through people bullshit but you keep shit cute i'm gonna keep it classy keep it moving and graceful i told him that uh, ain't no friends in the game you ain't learned that let all them bridges you ever came you ain't burned that yet self-righteous in a title but you swearing on the bible <laughs> I don't what she say. I don't wish death on them. I just reflect on them. What pills and potions? We're overdosing. I'm angry, but I still love you. <laughs> okay, like stop fucking playing with me, Debbie. 
it's more to it than money children need. Okay, like I said, you could be meeting a man. Like I said, Roxanne, Roxanne want to be my man. You could be meeting a man that's coming in to try to knock you off your fucking square. This man, first off, bitch, mind your business. Bad bitch every day like Christmas. Attitude don't fuck you. Pay me. Take more than a Bentley. The date got me fucked up. I don't trust. Ain't got more than me. Can't fuck. Ain't got more than me. I don't trust them. Ain't got more than me. I'll duck them. Okay? Ooh. I love it when they chase me. Okay? The, playing this cat-mouse game when in different realms that you ain't fucking used to and motherfuckers really got money and moving like that. Really got motherfuckers that can really gang stalk you, smear campaign you, got the money and motherfucking gas fights you to the extent that you never been gaslighted before. Got the money to motherfucking get you fucking touched. Probably put in situations that you never been before. Even if you have came to near death experiences, it ain't gonna be like how this is. And I ain't even trying to say that to scare nobody, but when when you mix money in possession and power uh, money and power shit that just speaks for itself nigga you can look at our history bible whatever fuck you whatever you want to look up at when you mix that motherfucking lust drugs if any drugs is involved and money and power the fuck is you talking about but they don't want you to know because these are both facing each other. Keep a wet wipe case of bum. Try to touch me. Ew. I feel like this is you telling them that newsletter in the reverse. Okay, so I'm hearing like, you know how people be doing interviews and shit like that? And then they be trying to start a pot and ask you some shit about some fucking beef. And like, the response be like, some shit that ain't got nothing to do with what the fuck they just asked you or some shit like that or just asked the person. I feel like that's what's gonna be going on. Like, motherfucker gonna come up to you like, oh, such a shit this, such a shit that. And you gonna be like, do my hair look okay? Are you gonna be like, you wanna go out tonight? <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, did you see my latest video? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're gonna be on some whole, like, why, like, why would you even repeat that shit back to me? Like, even if, like, what? Like, why would you come tell me some dumb ass shit like that? Dream life. Say what you mean, mean what you say. Because, period. How about your, your friends get with my friends? We can be friends. Date night. Just me and you. So, yeah, somebody's going to be mad because you're going to start dating somebody. And it's going to start off like, yeah, the friends, the people. It's going to be like a big party. But then at some point, it's going to like, they just want it to be just you and them. Infested. They're going to try to infest what the fuck you got going on. And I'm hearing invest too. Like this person going to be invested in you. And while they're investing in you, they're going to be trying to sabotage the fact that they're investing in you. So take that how the fuck it resonates as well. I know you probably can't see some of these goddamn cards. Even I'll be trying to show y'all because the way the light is in here. Because, you know, that's how the shadow box rooms are. Period. Then I got prison song in the reverse and I said um, some people has the authority some people have the authority and the power to throw their weight around some people have the authority and power to throw their weight around also I'm, like, I'm hearing it's a lot of lost souls it's a lot of lost souls I was making up some cars today and it was talking about, um, I want to exactly what I was looking at to make my car. They talking about the Lost Boys and shit. Um, about the little kids that got turned into donkeys on the Pinocchio. Or whatever. And I was just like, that shit's fucking crazy. Take it how it resonates. I don't know, look up spirit, animal donkey or something. Um, this could be doing something with a spirit baby. You might call him donkey. You might be out here acting a fucking donkey. I'm hearing donkey of the fucking day on the radio. Ricky Smiley show. Not Ricky Smiley, but Charlemagne. 
whatever breakfast club, whatever fuck that shit called. Take it how it resonates. Somebody could be um losing a child due to the fact that they're um keep repetitively doing shit to you. So the karma is gonna be bouncing back, like I said, with the law of attraction. You know what I'm saying? This could be due to CPS, you know, a neglect of any kind, abandonment, abuse of any kind. You know what I'm saying? Take it however it resonates. Spirit, can you give me some messages to close this out? Because we're just now at 20 minutes. Can you give me a message to close this out? Thank you. Projects, construction, let's build a house. Yeah, you moving up off the fucking projects. You on your way up out that bitch. And we've been in this energy for a minute, y'all. Like, for real, for real. So, congratulations. Like, I hope everybody get their motherfucking house. Everybody get their ten of cups that they want. Like, life would be just so easy if everybody just... Not everybody wants the same shit. Just give people the fuck they want. It's fat, me greasy. Ooh. <laughs> they don't want you to know what the fuck they doing, but you just like it's fat, me greasy. Cause they do that shit came facing down. And it says hot wings. But yeah, you on motherfucking fire. You you on fucking fire. I just heard. What's it called? Great Balls of Fire. It was like a rock and roll song. He'd be like, some, some Great Balls of Fire. <laughs> then it closed me out. These people ain't got nothing to say. Releasing pain. New tattoo. With your permission. Bloodshed. I'm going to do all the things that I said I'm going to do. Then it closed me out. So that's the end of y'all reading. Oh, uh, yeah. With your permission. Two, 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 two. On the motherfucking clock. Hey, with your permission. Okay, some y'all could be getting some new ink. Y'all could just be releasing pain of some sort or some kind. Y'all could be um coming out of some type of surgery or some kind or something like that. Some type of blood shit. Some type of sacrifice that you're giving to the universe. This could be giving birth to a child. Anything, like any type of blood shit. This could be... um. Practicing blood magic, you know what I'm saying? However the fuck you want to resonate with this, okay? But you are getting blessed. God just said with your permission, write it down. Say what you mean to me with the fuck you say. The tongue is the soul to the universe, baby, okay? Y'all see that rainbow? Your rainbow child could be coming, like I said. You know what I'm saying? Let your light shine bright. You don't dim that bitch for nobody. Period. It's Melanin Nation, Melanin Gang, Melanin Pop, Melanin Take It Over, motherfucking period. Ciao. Thank you for sticking tuned for my motherfucking shadow box reading. If you haven't already, smash that motherfucking sub and go ahead and smash that motherfucking like as well. All right. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Ciao. Oh, yeah. The time is 119 on the clock. October 26th. Okay. 48 on the fucking battery. So that's some fours on repeat. Because period. And then that's that one into that. You know what I'm saying? That's 10. And then 11. So we got we got double numbers on the board. So do y'all um do y'all homework with y'all numerology? Okay. I can't do everything for you guys. You know what I'm saying? I still got to do my homework and shit, too, <laughs> for myself. So, all right, y'all. Y'all have a wonderful morning or evening whenever you see this. And again, I'll see you in the next one. Ciao.